Aerobic metabolism uses oxygen to break down glucose and fat and produce ATP for muscular contraction. All aerobic metabolism occurs in the mitochondria of the muscle cell. The mitochondria is common to all cells, but they are found in prolific numbers within slow twitch muscle fibres. During aerobic training programs, the number and the size of mitochondria increase within the muscle cell. Over a 12 week period, the mitochondrial density can increase by up to 40%. This allows for greater amounts of ATP production from the aerobic system. Here's the basics of aerobic metabolism. A molecule of glucose is converted into pyruvic acid, which is then transported into the mitochondria. Fatty acids are cyclically metabolized within a process called the Krebs cycle, where fat and carbohydrate are metabolized and then passed along the electron transport chain for a net yield of between 36 and 460 ATPs. As the aerobic system requires quite a long list of chemical processes to occur, it takes a few minutes to get going and the aerobic system is typically related to long duration, continuous type activities. Sports and activities that require strength in this energy system include road cycling or swimming. In the gym, the aerobic system is best utilised during steady cardio training activities like cross trainer, bike and treadmill, as well as classes like spin class, step and aerobics.